My favourite type of holiday, look I always gravitate towards seaside locations um, and something that's always great for the kids as well. So we've been going to Fiji a lot lately so I love going there. Because it's warmer weather you pack lighter layers so um, I tend not to overpack and um, yeah just keep it really simple. I'm a super organised packer. Um, having three kids has made me that way. I think you have to be organised with kids. There's so much to pack, there's so much to remember. So being organised is key. I pack for a holiday by doing several things. I check the climate of where I'm going so I know what to pack. I you know, kind of roughly plan an itinerary so I know what my activity is going to be so I can pack accordingly for that. Yeah, I kind of see where we're staying as well and figure out, okay, if there's a gym or if there's um, a pool, um, do we sort of take things you know, that are going to allow us to do those things as well. So yeah, I kind of do like a little bit of a research beforehand. My essentials for a work trip, um, I kind of pack a little bit of a mini office so I make sure I've got all of my chargers, my devices, notebooks, um, pens, um, all sorts of things like that. Huge and it's a hard case, um, I've always gone with a bit of a hard case and um, yeah it's big because whether I'm travelling for myself I like to have enough room to kind of pack enough things to, to last me through the trip, but also when I'm packing for my kiddies as well, they have a lot of stuff. If I'm with the kids, I usually take quite a substantial bag that has lots of compartments that I can fit in, you know, sippy bottles, games, snacks, nappies, wipes, and you kind of want all that stuff like, really easy to grab. So that's when I'm traveling with kids. When I'm not, I keep it very simple and I usually just have a few little essentials for myself, my laptop, my wallet, my keys, my phone. And yeah, it's a lot easier when you're by yourself. A fully charged phone. Um, I like to listen to music on planes too, so I have my headphones as well. Um, and I always take a few little, especially on a long haul flight, beauty essentials. So I usually take a hydrating spray. I usually take my little restorative balm that is my multi-purpose uh, product from Mindful Life. So I use it as a lip balm, a heel cream. I use it um, with my cuticle beds on my nails to keep me kind of all polished. I think that's probably about it. I keep it really simple. Do not just chuck it all in like my partner. Um, I don't know how he manages to fit all the stuff in that he does, but he does. But I, I still think it's chaos at the other end. So I'm very much um, about maximising your space. Um, I stuff things inside shoes. <laughs> and if I'm taking, especially if I'm going on a holiday to an island and I have hats, I put objects inside, inside hats as well. So I try and kind of maximise every little nook and cranny that I can. We've got a facial oil, we've got um, a cream, an all-rounder moisturiser, we've got body oil, I have a hydrating spray, I have sunscreen. Usually something quite classic but comfortable. Um, I usually go with pants, I usually go with a flat shoe because, um, yeah, after having kids, I don't know, your feet just hurt. And I usually take something to keep me warm, I get quite chilly on the flight, so I usually take like a big wrap that can double up as a scarf as well. I bring candles, I travel with candles. I play music. Yeah, I try to kind of make it feel like I'm in a home away from home as much as I can. Thank you.